What if someone stole your imagination? Think about that for a moment. If they stole your imagination, what if through some unknown technology, some way they were able to rob you of your entire intelligence of what we know of as imagination? It's difficult to imagine, but think about this. Every notion that comes firsthand by way of imagining, but that notion would be impossible to entertain. An idea or wish would not be existing. They would not only deprive you of your dreams and ideas you entertain, but the loss of imagination would affect your ability to hope, to dream of better things, of better days. Perhaps even the ability to care, to really care, the ability to love might be altered, damaged, or destroyed. Without ever powerful imagination, we would lose the very signature of source, creativity. Without imagination, we would cease to be who we really are. That's because imagination is everything. What if someone stole your imagination? What if someone was enhancing your imagination daily? That's what bullying gray is doing. A belief is a specified measured limitation. Moves of negative intents, springs learning events. I am the vessel of spirit of infinite creative intelligence. I serve by creating what voice speaks within me now. That's a really important question. What voice speaks within you now? If you don't think you're the hologram, then you're part of the hologram. An imaginator seeks to interpret everything in a creative way that highlights its usefulness and unique probabilities to create forward. Are you aware of your thought feeling existence? What direction is your consciousness taking you? Are you drifting? or choosing thought? How are your thoughts guided? By what do you see and hear in books, movies, and conversation? But how do we know? Choose what we think. What I want to do is I want to have text as I am talking.